Hey, welcome back. My name is Sushant Sudish and I am an instructor for this MS700 Themes Administrator Associate Examination Series. In this demo walkthrough, we're going to see how to access Teams reports. In order to access Teams usage report, you need to have one of the following roles assigned. Office 365 Global Admin, Teams Service Admin, Teams Communication Admin, or Skype for Business Admin. You can access this report by going into Microsoft Teams Admin Center. And some of the reports you can access from the Teams Admin Center are Usage Activity, Device Usage, Teams Usage, Live Event Usage, PSTN Usage, and PSTN Block Usage, etc. I'm now in my Teams Admin Center. You can access Teams Admin Center by going into admin.teams.microsoft.com. On the left hand side, when you scroll down, you will be able to find analytics and reports. So click on usage reports. This is where you would be able to see different types of report. So let's go and explore a few of the different types of reports available. The first one is Teams Usage Report. This gives you details like active users, active users in Teams and channel, active channel messages, privacy settings for Teams guests in, in a team, etc. Let's explore Teams User Activity Report. So I'm going to click on one. This is going to give me a report on Teams activity. So I'm going to change the date to last seven days. As you can see that there is not so much information. I'm going to go back to 90 days to see some report within the within this status. So this report gives you one-on-one -on -one chat a user participated in, messages a user posted in a Teams chat, and messages a user posted in a private chat as well. And you would be able to get details like last activity date of a user as well. Let's explore Teams device usage report. As you can see, I don't have many usage report from other devices like Mac, iOS, Android, Chrome, operating system, Windows Phone or Linux. I only use one device to access Teams, which is Windows. So this gives details like is it a Windows user, Mac user, iOS user, Android phone user, etc. Let's explore what Teams live event usage is all about. So you can select days, click on run report. I have not run any Teams live event, so I really highlight unlikely to see any report, but this is where you would be able to see total views, start time, event status, organizer, presenter, producer, recording settings, production type, etc. All sort of live event usage report will be visible over here. Then there are other couple of important reports like PSTN block user, PSTN minute and SMS, PSTN and SMS preview reports as well. These report will give you timestamp user information related to your teams and PSTN uh, details, etc. Please note that the teams reports display the data for the users and channels which have been active. For example, if the user in your organization isn't active in teams during the date range specified for a report, data for that user will not be included in that report. Another functionality is you can download or export this report to a CSV file for offline analysis. So you can select export to Excel or then on the downloads tab, select download to download the report when it's ready. Then there is Microsoft 365 usage report. For that, you have to go to Microsoft 365 Admin Center, 
click on usage. Microsoft 365 usage analytics provide you with a better view of how your organization is adopting various services within Microsoft 365. At a glance, Activity Widgets gives you a cross product view of how users communicate and collaborate using other various services of Microsoft 365. And the Microsoft 365 usage analytics content represent a dashboard that provides a cross product view of last seven days, 30 days, 90 days, and 180 days. This data won't exist for all reporting periods right away. The report becomes available within 48 hours. Now that we have learned about how to access Teams report and Microsoft 365 usage report, in the next video, we're going to talk about Microsoft Teams authentication. So we'll see you in the next one. Till then, take care.